So we've moved a little upriver and we're now fishing for catfish, right? Catfish. All right, we're joined once again by owner and operator of uh, Ottawa River Guided Fishing at Yannick Larange. Okay, how is our uh, rod setup differ, uh, walleye versus catfish? Well, when we're catfishing, we're anchored. We find the big school of fish. I use my uh, iPilot, use the spot lock feature, keeps us right on the school. Okay. Uh, we want to fish right on the bottom where the catfish are, so this big sinker gets us down to the bottom yep. and leaves us there, and then these two hooks will be baited up and they'll be kind of swaying in the current and uh, hopefully appealing to some catfish down there. And why two hooks? Because that's twice as good as one. Okay, and what's the purpose of these little uh, red beads? Uh, it's just to uh, keep the, uh, the metal uh, spreader from going up and down. Okay, so now uh, we're still using worms? That one has worms on it. Mm -hmm. Worms generally get us our numbers of fish. To get the big fish, we've been getting a lot of five and six pound catfish lately. What's in the bag? It's kind of gross and it really stinks what catfish like to stink. So what it is... He's been is... hiding this from me. Yeah, it's just big, nasty, slimy, mushy minnows. Let's see them. Yeah. Oh, and you there we go. Right and we half. just rip them right in okay, half. Okay, I was like going that. to offer to bait this one, but now I'm not so Probably sure. Probably not a good idea. I'll do one, you do the other. We'll How about that? We'll hook this one right through the eye, just like that. Okay. Through the eye. And you're keeping an eye on your other rod. Yeah, because right? I'm expecting that one to go anytime. Because usually with the catfish on the good day, it's a fish every couple minutes. You okay. want to do that one? Yeah, oh yeah. It's not the full fishing experience if I don't get down and dirty. Okay, through the uh, tail or the, uh, the body? As long as the hook can come in one side and all the way out the other. Okay, in one side and out the other, like there so. You're perfect. Okay, there we go. Now, uh, about how deep are we at right We're now? We're in 44 feet of water right now. Okay, so, so you should can, I just drop it in? You can drop it on that side of the outboard. I'll hold this one over on this side. And with the catfish, generally, if we don't get a fish in about 15 minutes, we're on the we're probably on the wrong spot. The school might take a bit of time to find us. Catfish feed by scent a lot. So once the school finds us, generally we'll get a good flurry of action. Sometimes we'll drop right on the school and get fish right away. Okay, I'm on the bottom. Should You're I leave the it bottom? smack wanna, dab on the bottom oh, or pick it up a bit? You want to uh, find the bottom yep. and then let out a bit more line. And then you let want out the a bit bottom more. and then some. Gotcha. Okay. And oftentimes with catfish, less is more. The less you move, the more fish you, you get. Okay. But uh, sometimes they like just a little jiggle. You don't want to lift the sinker off the bottom, but just a little jiggle, jiggle like that will get them going sometimes. Okay. So now they uh, they search for their food by scent. Yeah. Okay, so there's certain fish that like the stinkier uh, bait and others it doesn't make like, a difference? Yeah, pretty much like catfish. Scent tends to usually help. Like when I'm bass fishing, I'll usually put a bit of scent on my on my artificial lures. To, it, it might be more mental, but it, I find that it makes a difference. Okay. All right, so uh, so just a little bit of jiggling now and then. I, I find it so hard to stay still when I'm fishing. Uh, I always want to be pulling on the rod. Oftentimes, especially when we're guiding kids for catfish, we'll bring the bench. I have a bench here that folds right up, and we'll yep. just lean the rods right there, and I'll tell them some great jokes, and they'll laugh while we're watching the rods. And then uh, when there's a bite, uh, they'll grab it, set the hook, and reel them in. Are they better jokes than your stick roll joke? Uh, no. Earlier, Generally I caught a not. stick. So Yannick said the Ottawa River River is great for stick roll. Uh, <laughs> All right, uh, so uh, kind of an exciting winter for you. you yes. Before you were just Ottawa River uh, guided fishing. Yes. But now you've also purchased the company Fishing Just for Kids. So That's right. So how does that guided tour differ from what you, you offered before? Well, when we're fishing with kids, it's generally more about numbers and size. Mm -hmm. So we'll be going, we'll be doing this, doing catfish, especially when we're really on them and we're catching one every couple minutes. It's great. Okay. Or we'll be going after sunfish because it's... Pluck it, drop your line in, pull one out, drop it in, Perfect. pull one out. Yeah. Okay, head to either of the websites to learn more information, but we're gonna keep at it. We are, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like we can get a catfish before the end of the show. Stay with us, we'll find out at the uh, end of uh, the show today on CTV Morning Live.